High School Class of 2020. I'm leaving for college in a few days. Ah! This is crazy, man. I don't even know. Like, this is crazy. College. Packing up your entire life and not really knowing what comes next is really scary until you do it. Oh my god! I've now decided that if more adults kept the mindset of a freshman of college their first week, then the world would be a happier place. So this is perfect. Um, yeah, we're just gonna move in now. For the very first time, you're on your own and you're setting up the space that's entirely yours and you realize that you can do literally anything you want. And I mean anything. I know it can be scary to put yourself out there, but once you do, you will meet some of the best friends you've ever had and probably feel the most free you felt in your entire life. We'll be young You'll start learning about things that actually interest you, which is so exciting, and it won't be too overwhelming because they start out pretty slow. Hey, okay, so this is a little life update. Hi, it's September 26th. I'm just vibing, man. I had a great night last night. We went out to app and they were blasting music. And I'm finally getting on top of things and figuring out this whole college thing. I just started writing out stuff in my planner. I had all my acapella callbacks last week, which were four of them, and it was crazy. I haven't had a breakdown at school once yet, and I've been in college classes officially for a month. That's pretty fucking cool. I'm really happy. <laughs> I'll see you soon. I love you. Have a good day. When we wake. So I took off full swing, I started classes, I joined an acapella group, I kept doing YouTube, I just was doing everything I possibly could. So I got a nice little, little setup going, my planner with everything organized, my camera because I'm vlogging today, my pumpkin coffee. As cool and as exciting and new as everything was, it started to become really overwhelming really quickly and if you're not careful and you don't please yourself, you're gonna start to feel like this. But as impossible as it may feel sometimes, you're the one who has to pick yourself back up. Okay, so basically what you guys just saw was my mental breakdown after a three hour programming lab. I'm still very new to programming and I kind of struggled a bit, I overcomplicated things, but... And then I had to take a physics test right after that. But now I'm just gonna get some Duncan and try and forget about it. You have to take care of yourself after the hard days in any way you know how. And it's really easy tonight to go back to my dorm and just not study or do anything productive because I'm so tired and I did a lot today and it was hard and stressful, but I'm ready to keep going. <laughs> it's such a nice night, man. Sometimes you just gotta get out and walk around and just enjoy the night because it's really nice. Even in the dead of winter in Binghamton, it's still a nice night out. <laughs> your friends and your family aren't always gonna know when you're having a hard time, so you have to be the one to get yourself out of bed and tell them and work on it yourself and keep those habits that make you feel really alive. And the things that you really wanna do and your goals, make all of those things a priority because no one is gonna do that for you, so you have to put yourself first. Amazing things will happen when you start to focus on these things. Then hey, I'm Leah. Then hey, I'm Leah. Then hey, I'm Leah. Then hey, I'm Leah. Then, hey, I'm Leah. People are starting to recognize me. Like I've had multiple people in the past week come up and be like, you make YouTube videos, right? And I'm like, yeah. Getting noticed for the first time as a YouTuber is like the craziest thing ever. <laughs> So much I could tell you about your freshman year of college. I did it, cut! <laughs> Get the cameras! <laughs> but what I want to tell you is to enjoy every second of it because before you know it, this day is gonna come. This is my last night of freshman year. Where the heck did it go, bro? I don't even know. <laughs> Saying your goodbyes are never easy, but just remember that this is only the beginning and that this will be a year that you'll remember for the rest of your life.